Welcome members in the Fordham community are upset that another homeless shelter is coming to their neighborhood. News 12's Cecilia Hua was there to hear their concerns. This is really unfair. It's like this area has become just a cluster uh, for these shelters. A concerned Fordham resident speaking out against a proposed stabilization bed program coming to their neighborhood. We're property owners, you know, we're looking for quality businesses to come. We're looking to improve our quality of, of, of life and, and, and public safety. Operated by Acacia Network Housing, what used to be a family shelter at 2287 University Avenue is planned to turn into a 59 single room shelter for men. This just a few blocks away from a 200 bed men's shelter on Landing Road. I'd rather see a, a family than an individual uh, men. Right now things are not that well as far as the Bronx with crime as high as it is. Community members tell us they only found out about these plans last month at a community board meeting. We deserve to know. There was a process issue here. We should have been notified before. These conversations should have happened earlier. We were notified late. Council member Sanchez will be hosting a virtual town hall tomorrow for community members to discuss their concerns along with representatives from Acacia Networks and the Department of Homeless Services. So it's not that we want to have all of the shelters in the city of New York be cited here, but there's something called fair share. Uh, and that, that concept is that, you know, we should do our share. Everyone should do their share uh, to house the most vulnerable neighbors in the city of New York. The stabilization bed program will also offer on-site social work and permanent housing services. Reporting from Fordham, Cecilia Hua, News 12. Cecilia, thank you. The Department of Homeless Services tells us this stabilization bed facility will have staff working closely with individuals experiencing homelessness to rebuild trust as they restabilize their 